name's Jeff Amon. I play bass in Pearl Jam. I'm at the uh, House of Vans in Brooklyn, checking out the spot where it all goes down. Hooking up with uh, Steve Alba and Jeff Grasso, and Christian Hasoy, and uh, Ray Barbie. It's uh, another dream session for me, so I'm excited to hang out with the Vans boys. I started wearing Vans uh, when I was about 12 years old, when I first started skating. So the idea of actually doing a collaboration with Vans was uh, was, was pretty exciting, and it sort of feels like it's been, uh, I don't know, like 12, 15 years in the works. Well, Talk is one of my favorite artists in the whole skate culture. Like I think just his style and just his sensibility and how he incorporates uh, fonts and designs. This year is the 20th anniversary uh, of our existence as a band. That was probably the biggest reason that we decided to, to release these sh shoes right now. Most things Pearl Jam are red, black, and yellow, so those are the, those are the colors that are incorporated into the shoes and uh, this particular pair of shoes. Uh, the other shoes are uh, supersonic green and gold, which is uh, a tribute to our uh, now defunct NBA team, Seattle Supersonics. And then we also have the classic grunge Pendleton flannel uh, skate high and uh, I believe there's a slip-on too that's uh, in the flannel. You know, Grasso did a good job. The notch in the back is genius. Padded tongue, the eyelets. It's just a little bit of a beefier uh, version of the original skate high, so very comfortable. Uh, I love it. I especially love the yellow stitching. Waffle. <laughs> There's not a better shoe that works on grip tape than the waffle. I mean, it's like, it's the, it's the be all end all shoe. Jim and I just had a conversation with Steve about uh, the, the profits from these shoes going to uh, build a skate park in Pine Ridge, South Dakota on, on the reservation there. And uh, I think that could be the beginning of a, of a long, relationship.